Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of unboxing and brief review video. And today I'll be presenting a webcam which is the Microsoft LifeCam HD 3000. I have had another cam in the past uh, which is the Logitech Pro C920. And uh, that camera or that cam is double in price comparing to the LifeCam HD 300. So I'll just go over some uh, basics first and then we'll do the unboxing and then I'll uh, test the cam and I'll attach, uh, do a comparison with the Logitech which is double in price and then you'll see the test clips for this cam and both the Logitech cam. So let's uh, start with some uh, basics first. So here's uh, how the box look like. looks like and then this is HD3000. And I'll just go over some uh, of the specs right here. So this is a 720p HD camera. This is not 1080. And it has widescreen and certified for Skype. I believe that doesn't mean anything. It just means that it works on Skype. And then uh, this is Windows 10 compatible, uh, which is on the front right here. And uh, that's it for the box. So let's start with uh, unboxing the box and open up the camera. So once you open the box and then you get the cam, that's all it is. Let me just take a look here if uh, there's anything underneath this packaging. And uh, looks like it's empty here, so there's nothing in there. And then I'll take out the cam. Uh, I really have to take out the whole thing. And then I'll put it aside here and actually I see there's a brochure here so I'll take that out uh, which is right here and there's another warranty card so I'll put it here so the box is empty right now let's put the box in here and this is the small flyer or brochure Actually, it doesn't say much. It just tells you to uh, connect it to your laptop or computer via USB uh, cable. And then uh, basically that's it. And it looks like here you can put it on top of your uh, screen or on a flat surface uh, this way. And then we have here the warranty card and the guide. And actually we have, looks like we have something more in here. I'll just put this aside and let's take out the cam from the packaging here. I successfully took out the cam from a slightly complicated packaging. And then uh, here's the cam you're looking at. So here's the cable connected to the cam. Uh, you cannot remove it. This is attached to the back of the cam. and actually okay this one bendable so you can just you know change the shape or change the uh, size uh, to make it the way you want so you can put it this way uh, or if you want you can put it this way this way okay so you can put it like this or you can I believe you can just even, okay, uh, no, I don't think you can do that, so, okay, so it looks like that's another way of keeping it, uh, okay, so the default way is this way, which was on the packaging right here, okay, so here's the cam we have, so I'll do some testing of this cam and I'll do some testing of the Logitech cam I had and then I'll just attach them to the main video and in that way you'll see that you know whether 
it's worth paying the double price to buy the Logitech C920 or this is good enough this is uh, about 35 to 40 dollars Canadian and the Logitech is about uh, 80 90 Canadian depending on uh, the retailers so you're paying half than Logitech if you have this one so uh, the unboxing part of this is uh, NCR and I'll attach some sample videos and then I'll just uh, see you shortly. Thank you. Hello everyone. I'm back to test the Microsoft LifeCam HD 3000. So what you're looking at right now is uh, recorded through the Microsoft HD LifeCam 3000. And I'm gonna run this camera just for about a minute. And then once I'm done, then I'll start uh, videoing with the Logitech C9200 camera and then you'll be able to see uh, or compare which one you like most and or which one is better so this one is just uh, recording my face right now and I have a lamp or a desk lamp right on my right side which is right there and uh, the lamp is kind of uh, not directly uh, towards my face it's just on the table and the light you're seeing is the reflection of the light from the table and on uh, another computer so behind me is the background uh, of my window and today is a cloudy day so you'll see uh, a little bit uh, dark uh, in here and I'll use the same uh, setup for the Logitech and then you'll be able to see how it looks so I'm going to stop this right now and let's go back to Logitech Hello everyone, I'm back again with the Logitech C920 HD webcam. I believe by mistake I was referring to Logitech C9200 uh, in the last clip. Uh, I'm sorry about that. So it, it is C920, not 9200. So right now what you're looking at is through the Logitech C920 HD webcam. And as you can see, if you look at the look at my face and the background, it looks like that. You know, it's making me look smaller. Uh, it's not. Uh, it's wider than the Microsoft uh, Live Cam, so I think it's uh, giving you a wider look. But that makes me smaller in terms of uh, the Microsoft uh, Live Cam. And I haven't changed anything, uh, same lighting, same setup, same chair, same everything. So I just uh, switched to a Logitech camera from the live cam uh, cameras recording before. So you can see the difference. Uh, it's uh, making me look smaller and making the environment wider. So this is not a bad camera, but however, uh, my preference would be to record with the Microsoft LifeCam uh, because uh, I I'm more uh, the the viewing or image the Microsoft LifeCam is rendering. I like it better than uh, the Logitech uh, what the Logitech uh, Logitech is uh, rendering. So the the choice is up to you. If you like uh, what you see through this Logitech camera, then you may want to go for Logitech. But if you like what you uh, see through the Microsoft Live Cam, then you may want to go for the Microsoft Live Cam. So uh, it is my decision that I'm going to be recording uh, this type of video uh, when I talk in front of my uh, uh, webcam, with my which is attached to my laptop. I'm going to be using Live Cam uh, instead of Logitech. So that's my decision. And keep in mind that uh, the Logitech uh, costs double than the Microsoft Live Cam. So Logitech would cost you in Canada about 80 to 90 dollars depending on where you buy from or when you buy from. And the Microsoft Live Cam would cost about 35 dollars, uh, 40 dollars. So it's uh, exactly the double the price. But if you look at the image quality, I don't believe it's giving you double uh, better the image. So I'm going to stick to the Microsoft Live Cam. So that concludes the unboxing review and comparing Microsoft uh, Live Cam HD with the uh, Logitech. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Uh, there will be more videos coming up. And also, I would like to mention that uh, my Asia trip is coming up in about three weeks. So for uh, within three, in three weeks, I'll be leaving Canada. 
and then I'm going to be going to countries like Bangladesh, India. So there's going to be lots of travel videos. So if you haven't sub subscribed already, it is time to subscribe now. If you'd like to see uh, lots of uh, travel videos, business class review videos, business class lounge videos, uh, and all sorts of uh, videos, which is going to be totally different than what you're seeing right now. So I'll see you again. Thank you for watching, and please subscribe and like. Bye.